Recently, I've been doing something rather bad, is drinking coffee. Yeah, my, I need to do food shopping. Um, follow me on Patreon. <laughs> Join the Patreon team and help me out. Yay. Anyway, my body cannot... Oh my god, the dirty dishes. <laughs> anyway, just wash my hair. And I'm listening to Alfie Days in the background. Um, <laughs> My body cannot tolerate coffee, but I've been really tired lately, clearly. I've um, been stressing out a whole bunch about uh, my health and mostly about money because I can't seem to find a job that fits my schedule, which obviously it should be the other way around if I'm desperate for a job. Beggars can't be choosers, but yada yada yada. I've been super tired lately, so what I've discovered is that if I take like three sips of coffee in the morning after breakfast, I feel okay. I really don't like the taste of black coffee though, but no sugar, no milk. Three sips. Mazzy. So bitter. Mm. Anyway, time to start the day. Yay, happy Wednesday. I just want to sleep all day and not think about my impending homelessness <laughs> this is like from a vending machine downstairs by the way <laughs> look at this it's my little moment of fame there i was there <laughs> ah there i am again yay <laughs> oh my gosh it's the little moments it's the little things so I was at my local supermarket to, uh, on my way back from school and I like checking out the drinks because uh, fall is coming so they have so many new, like, new seasonal stuff, a lot of chestnut stuff. I don't know if you can hear the rain outside but it is chucking it down. Anyway, I was checking out the drinks and they had two new types, actually I don't know if they're new, but they had two types of soy milk that I had never seen before. This one is the dorayaki flavor and the other one is tiramisu. I just put it back in the fridge but I'm gonna have it later. Uh, tiramisu seemed kind of straightforward to me. I was like, uh, it's gonna taste of, you know, like cinnamon and stuff. Is there cinnamon and tiramisu? Shit. It, you know, it seemed kind of like a familiar flavor to me. Even like the, the little, uh, carton, uh, was like <laughs> Italia, Italia? Fuck's sake, I cannot speak. Italian colors, so like, little European feel. But the dorayaki one is the one I really wanted to try first. I just had a sip and... You know what? It's kind of spot on. Like, how did they do that? Like, I can taste the uncle. And I can taste, like, the pancake kind of thing. Like, it tastes like kind of like maple syrup at uncle. And I thought it was going to be, like, really weird, but it's, it kind of works. It's kind of good. I can't stop drinking it. Obviously, you also taste the soy milk. That's so weird! I like it! What? Anyway, <laughs> if you're in Japan and this is still around, give it a try. It's not bad. Yeah. Anyway, I'll try two remisu later. I don't want to open them both. I'm just going to enjoy this. Um, yeah, top lighting. I'm not having the best week. I don't know if I filmed anything with this week. I think I filmed like a snippet. Um, but I think... Hmm... Yeah, I don't know what's up with me this week. Like, I can't focus. And as you can see, like, I'm talking really fast. And, like, I have a thousand different thoughts in my head. So I just need to chill out. Um, I just wrote, like, I, I put a story up on my Instagram telling people, like, okay, tomorrow, Friday morning, just bully me into getting some work done. done because I'm procrastinating. Like, I don't want to do anything. Like, in the evening, I'm, like, kind of hyper like this. And my energy is okay. Um, and I can like, I can study, but I'm jittery, like I keep going, I'm all over the place, like I, I've got energy, but I cannot focus on anything, my voice just echoed in this room, <laughs> which means I might be speaking too loud, anyway, can you, do I look really this tired, I think it's the top lighting, anyway, like, like this, like I'm going from one thing to another, like, 
I'm guessing this is kind of what ADHD might be like. I don't know. Anyway, what am I saying? Um, yeah, in the evening, I'm like, I am super energized, but I can't focus. I'm like, yeah, tomorrow morning is going to be so good. I'm going to get so many workouts in. I'm going to wake up early. It's all going to be good. I'm going to do this, this, and this. And I'll have this, this, and this done by the end of my morning work for school and everything. And in the morning, I wake up and it's like I have zero ser serotonin in my brain or in my body. And it's just like I can't even, like I have to push myself to even like get out of bed and take a shower and wash my hair and revise whatever I need to revise before school. Like it's such a chore. Like it's night and day how I feel in the evening and in the mornings. And I don't know if it's due to what's been going on with my mental health lately. I don't know if it's to do with the anti-anxiety SSRI medication that I'm taking. I don't know if uh, it's my PMDD or, you know, like, I don't know what the hell is going on. It's so frustrating. Anyway, I wanted to show you this drink and then I also wanted to update you and then I just went on, like, on a complete tangent. But yeah, why am I itchy? Did I get bitten by a bug while I was just talking to you guys? Anyway, super rainy, end of summer, kind of sad, almost the end of the semester at school, so... But yeah, I'll update you as that gets closer. I don't want to go in a full on ramble. Ah, uh, the stupid rain! I was listening to the last like cicadas. They're slowly going away. It's almost done. I'm sure they were loud as hell, but first of all, they were late because basically had no rainy season. So they took like their sweet ass time coming out. And then they were super loud, but it was still like summer vibes. And then now like the crickets are starting to appear, which is a sign of fall. Ugh, I want more cicadas. I'm not ready for the end of summer. I don't want fall, but fall is like rain and gray and then winter and then cold and then sad and then low sunlight and then sad, sad, sad. <laughs> uh, I wish it was summer more often. More lo longer. Yeah, anyway, and it also I guess it's kind of too hot here. So, I don't know, maybe I'll enjoy fall. Fall. Ugh, stop talking. Just stop talking. <laughs> Good morning everyone, I made it, I'm awake, I'm up, I've already, oh, what time is it? It's almost 9am I think, I've already done a lot of inking, I mean I've showered, I've had breakfast, I've done a whole bunch of inking, so I'm really happy of the progress, uh, now I'm taking a small break while I download a video that I have to edit for some clients, and I had my second drink, the tiramisu drink, oh my god, it's so good! Mmm. How do they do it? It tastes exact, exact, exactly like tiramisu. I think I might actually like this one better than the dorayaki, and I actually enjoy the dorayaki. Anyway, um, anyway, thank you to everyone who sent me some wake up messages. I really appreciate it. I know I look, I look rough. I always look rough these days. My health isn't great still, but. I'm so happy I got up, I'm so happy that I'm working, I'm so happy that I'm doing a lot of progress and I'm happy that I'm getting this little tiramisu drink uh, for a break. Yeah! So I'm gonna go edit that video and I gotta do... Oh my god, I gotta do laundry and I gotta do the dishes. Oh my god, yeah, I need to get going. Thank you! Yo, a long time no talk. <laughs> it's a Sunday. I am doing nothing today because I have a busy week ahead. And honestly, we all deserve some rest. We all deserve a day to just look gross. <laughs> watch Netflix or anime or anything you want all friggin day. I just binged like the entire season of Devil in Ohio, which I looked promising, but in the end it was kind of like a dumb high school. Oh, sorry. 
I'm very critical of the movies and series I watch, but for me it was just like another dumb high school thing with kind of the horror culty twist. This is not a spoiler. Oh, this is my watch reminding me that I need to take my SSRI medication, which I'm still on, <laughs> by the way, if you didn't know. Um, uh, also, I did something really bad, is that I ordered... I ordered Uber Eats. <laughs> it's not good. It's not good at all. And the worst of it is that I didn't even order anything healthy for myself. I ordered um, cake, basically. I think I ordered like chocolate banana muffins or something that I've never tried before. So I'm hoping they're good um, because I'm on my period and uh, whatever. Mother Nature makes us do crazy things sometimes. Deal with it. C'est la vie chaud um, But I do dislike spending money because I'm so good at like being you know like super careful with my spending during the week and then I turn into this hungry beast because um yeah I'm getting skinnier by the second uh, <laughs> from not eating enough during the week time and just like counting coins and counting grains of rice and then all of a sudden the hunger takes over and I'm like, Uber Eats, give me food! And yeah, this is what happens and then I feel guilty about it. Fun. Um, but yeah, I'm still gonna enjoy it. I'll just feel a little dumb afterwards when I like, uh, well, um, <laughs> what do I do? How do I pay rent? Okay, it's not that bad yet. Money is coming in. I do have orders. I just don't have enough money coming in. And I haven't done YouTube in... I'm, I'm filming, but I haven't had time to edit videos because I'm focusing on things that actually earn me money. And, oh gosh. <laughs> I need some water. I'm gonna get some water. At least I, I'm gonna hydrate myself today. I'm gonna eat a bunch of junk food, but I'm gonna stay hydrated. And I'm gonna watch... I don't know what I'm gonna watch next. Anime? I don't know. I'm so bad at doing nothing. I get bored, but it's like, okay, if you're bored, maybe you should go work. And I'm like, nah... <sighs> almost on holiday almost have some time off i am so looking forward to that okay i look disgusting <laughs> let's go even though i feel pretty guilty of eating all of this by myself i am going to show you what i got because honestly they look pretty good and they're all like handmade i think what they say it is handmade yeah see handmade this tastes, this taste warms the cookies of the heart. Ooh, that's sweet. This one is the banana one. Oh, the cockles of the heart. <laughs> the cookies of the heart. The cookies of the heart would have been kind of cute also. And it also is the same actually. Chocolate, banana, Earl Grey, and lemon. Yeah, I'm binging today. You know what? Well, sometimes we deserve it. You deserve it. I deserve it. Itadakimasu. Good morning, everyone. <laughs> I woke up like maybe 30 minutes ago. It's just past 6 a.m. and I had an errand to run. And now I'm showing you my feet walking because <laughs> I don't want to dox myself. Um, <laughs> but hopefully you can hear me because I have to wear a mask. Uh, quite a lot of people already out this early in the morning. Wow. But I just wanted to get this errand done and over with, basically. Uh, had some issues with the delivery. Uh, in the end, I was like, you know what, just go deliver it to the closest locker place. It was my first time using a locker for receiving our delivery, so I was kind of nervous about it, but it's exactly the same system as in Belgium. You just type in your your passcode that you receive and then, oops, the door swings open and then you have your package. Um, the only thing is that the, the automated, the only thing is that the automated voice is super loud probably because it's in the station so usually there's a lot of hustle and bustle but because it was so early it was kind of quiet so 
You could just hear the robot lady's voice. Anyway, I just wanted to get that done with. And now I'm going back and I'm gonna take a shower and I'm gonna have breakfast and start the day. But yeah, it's already super light out for like before 7 a.m. It's crazy. And already a lot of people commuting to work. Japanese lifestyle. for some nice cards for my Patreons. Oh, and I'm loving these autumn ones. This is loft, by the way. Hey, <laughs> Saturday morning. I am slightly hungover, but I need to be somewhere, so we cannot stay here all day. I also got terrible period cramps, so I'm definitely taking some paracetamol today to just survive. It's it's I, not work thing. I just I'm just gonna hang out with a friend, uh, and it's gonna be fun. And I don't know what we're gonna do. It's probably gonna be chill. But I am slightly hungover. Um, long time no hangover, actually. I've been pretty good with not overindulging with alcohol, but also Japanese beer is kind of tricky. I don't I, what's the word? Treacherous? <laughs> I can't find the word. But it's like, oh, it's so light. I don't feel anything. Like, I, I'm, not, I'm not even buzzed. And then you're like five, six beers in, and it's like, oh it's happening <laughs> which is basically what happened yesterday i was hanging out with uh, benjamin uh my friend from the the pokemon uh, cafe video so we finally got to hang out again we keep saying we're gonna hang out but we're all we're not in the same class anymore and we're busy but we still keep in touch and we keep saying we're gonna hang out but finally happened so we went for yakitori and we started having a few beers there and then we went to karaoke finally like my very first karaoke experience like how many times have i been to japan how long have i been living here and i still haven't done karaoke karaoke <laughs> is is crazy but i've been like too shy to to even try uh, but I think <laughs> going with Benjamin was probably the best way to um, to start that karaoke journey because it was a lot of fun and we have like we're a similar age and we have like the similar similar kind of taste in music so we were kind of rocking out but obviously we had more to drink at karaoke we had, actually did the no mi hodai which is like all you can drink option so we had to, uh, you know, compensate, like, at least drink more <laughs> to make up for the price of the nomi hodai. So, um, yeah, I'm definitely feeling that this morning. I'm just waiting for my laundry to finish, uh, and then I'm just gonna go get ready. Um, this is like the equivalent of Aquarius, if you didn't know. Like, I'm, a, I'm sure most of you guys know, but I'm also making these vlogs for my friends and family back in Belgium who might not know, so... If you're being like, duh, but yeah. Equivalent of Aquarius, just different company. Uh, Aquarius is owned by Coca-Cola, I think this is... I don't know what it's owned by... Who cares? But yeah. It's been a super busy week. I still have a few more days. Monday's a holiday, and I have two more days of school. And I'm done for the semester. I get like about two weeks off and then I start a brand new semester. Hopefully, I think technically I go up a class. I hope. <laughs> I hope I didn't fail. I 
bombed my placement test by the way it's so bad but other than the placement tests my grades are, are okay so yeah i don't know why i did that yeah and i think that's why my voice is croaky karaoke and slightly hungover i should have filmed but like first experience um and also we were just like chilling like hanging out together so <sighs> Yeah, I'm I'm glad I have a a good friend here in Japan. Like, you know, like um uh, European and we can like share our experiences, like our dating experiences <laughs> with Japanese culture and all that stuff. So yeah, I'm still I can't hear the laundry. I hope it's done. Yeah, I'm stalling because I'm waiting for the damn laundry to finish and I haven't heard it beep yet But I'm pretty sure it should be done by now. So I'm gonna go check on that. Okay Let's go When you have anxiety about the most stupid thing and you live in a shared house and you're working from home so you look like shit and you really have to pee but there are a bunch of men <laughs> in the corridor doing construction they've been doing construction since 9 a.m. it is now almost 2 p.m. I should have gone during their work break but I didn't think they would still be right outside my door they have been drilling and doing some heavy duty work And also, I would like to go outside, just like outside the building. I would like to go take a walk. <laughs> I would like to take in some fresh air before going back to my to my work, which I've been doing for four hours straight. Which is why I haven't noticed that I had to pee until now. Because <laughs> I forgot to take a friggin' break because that's how I am. Fun. I can hear step ladders being moved. Wires being placed. I think there are right outside my door. Step ladder. What do I do? I know this is stupid. Like, just go outside, go pee. They probably have a path set for people who have to go to the bathroom and get out of their room, but. Stupid anxiety that wants me to get a bladder infection. <laughs> 